Hello, this is Stuart from the Photomatics team, and I'm going to show you how to set up automatic exposure bracketing on a Fujifilm X-T2. This will let you take three photographs, each at a different exposure, when you press the shutter button. Switch the camera on, and with the shutter speed dial, select A for automatic. And make sure that the exposure compensation dial is set to zero. Locate the drive mode and turn the lower part of the dial to select BKT for bracketing. On the back of the camera, on the right, you'll find a set of four buttons known as the selector, and in the center, the menu OK button. Press the menu button and the menu appears on screen. Now press the left hand selector button to highlight the current menu. Pressing the lower selector button twice takes you to the Shooting Settings menu. Then press the right-hand selector button once to access it. Drive settings should now be highlighted. Press the right-hand selector button to access the menu. The first item on the next screen is Bracketing Setting. To access it, press the right-hand selector button. The second item on the next screen is AEB BKT, Auto Exposure Bracketing. Press the lower selector button once to select it, followed by the right hand selector button. Here you're going to choose how many photos you're going to take and at which exposure values. The first item on this menu is Frame Step Setting. Press the right hand selector button to access it. This screen is split into two. On the left, you can choose how many photos you want to take, referred to as frames, and on the right, the EV setting, referred to here as step setting. Starting with frames, select the number of bracketed photographs you would like to take using the upper or lower selector buttons. Here I'll select plus minus three frames. Now with the right hand selector button, select the other side of the screen, the step setting. This sets the spacing between your bracketed exposures. A spacing of two EV steps gives you a good exposure range with just three bracketed frames. However, we recommend not to exceed two EV steps as to ensure the best quality. To select two EV steps, use the upper or lower selector buttons and select two step. In effect, what you've chosen are three photographs at a 2 EV spacing. One photo at two stops underexposed, one photo exposed normally, and one photo two stops overexposed. Below the menu OK button is the back button. Press it once. So that you can take all three photographs just by holding your finger on the shutter button, here you'll need to adjust the second item on this menu to read continuous. To select it, press the lower button once, followed by the right hand button, and then the lower button. To save it, press OK. To exit the menu settings and return to the main screen, press the back button four times. Once back at the main screen, on the left of the display, you will find the exposure indicator. Check that the center marker is at zero. But if it isn't, then you can relocate it using the exposure compensation dial. All you need to do now is to keep the camera still, press and hold down the shutter button until all your photos are taken.